watching this video right now, that means that I'm finally putting my thoughts into action. If you're a subscriber, a returning viewer, or you just stumbled upon this video, first of all, thank you for clicking, but don't click off just yet. Second of all, I hope that you can feel the love, peace, and comfort that I'm trying to share. Hi, I'm Julia, and welcome to my golf swing. I almost threw it. <laughs> Is all who enter. Here's the tree and the uh, little peanut. The angle that I want. Oh my god. Obviously, it's not gonna wrap. I really wanted to talk today about the action stuff. Jeez, bird, seriously. Are there wolves in these woods? Oh my gosh, a bird brought some presents. Or that was totally as well. Really, where did that actually come from? Now we're here, there's two peanuts. What the heck? I don't want to disturb their thing, so I'm gonna be thinking. This bird, all the way up there. So, I don't know how to find like, the angle that I want. That's, oh my god. I guess this will have to do. This is kind of sick. Sitting on this here tree that I'm in. She's so this is one seat. This is also a little hook for your bag. I did not put mine there because it's really heavy. Anyways. Hi, I'm Julia and welcome to my corner of the internet or of the forest. I'm currently sitting in this magnanimous tree. I call this tree a four-seater because like five people can sit in here. Four-seater and then I say five. Anyways, I'm so so grateful for this little community that we're building here together. I've always thought about, desired, wanted to share myself and the things that I like, my interests, my hobbies. So thank you for watching and subscribing and tuning in. I really wanted to talk today about the action step, which is the next step. And I realized when I got here that I left all my notes in the car. As I mentioned in the last episode, check it out after you finish with this video. I write down my ideas a lot so I can offload them, which makes space for new thoughts and new ideas. But this often just leads to a huge list of unfinished tasks or half-started tasks. Well, let me actually see if I have notes on my phone. No. <laughs> Chipmunk heard that and ran away. It might be in my notion. It's one thing to think about something, but it's another to actually do it. A mental world and thinking is kind of like the map for your attention, and then action is how you get to your destination. The destination is kind of like the thought. Thinking is part of the battle. There's actually been a scientific study- Jeez, bird, seriously. There's actually been a scientific study done, I'll link it in the description below. It basically proves that if you think about doing something, your body can't really tell the difference, so it thinks that it's kind of already done it. Not to the same degree or extent, but still a little bit. So the study is about strengthening your muscles. It shows that there actually was an increase in strength after imagining doing an exercise, and they did compare it to a control group that actually did the exercise, as well as a control group that did no exercise and no imaginary exercise. And I find that crazy. Ever since I read that study, I have been mind practicing things. One thing that I've been mind practicing recently is my golf swing. I almost threw it. <laughs> That's hilarious. But yeah, mind practicing is a thing, guys. That was great. That was so strange. That was great. Maybe here for my shorts and yes i'm an artist but i'm so much more than that as humans we are such multi-dimensional and complex beings it's really hard to encompass us in just one word or just one category of things and trying to share all those aspects in a one minute short is almost laughable so i came here to share i initially started off on tiktok making fun videos with my friends during our high school spare oh my gosh that was literally so long ago i feel ancient whenever i think about high school but i had one video that did amazing this was actually after i graduated high school and in my first year of university and it got like three million views and it still gets likes to this day even though it's been like four years it's kind of crazy that i've been on tiktok for like four years i'm actually planning on making a video of like reacting to my old tiktoks so if you think that'll be funny or if you don't want to watch that let me know leave a comment and i will drop that video soon some of my old tiktoks were actually unhinged like i'm gonna put one on the screen but i don't know if i'm gonna have to like block it out because it's, it's like inappropriate but it's funny <laughs> it's funny anyways as i 
My battery's low. But I write down my ideas a lot so I can offload them. This often just leads to a huge list of unfinished tasks or half-started tasks. For example, my phone storage. I like to document my life both through video and through photo. I mean, I'm always out in nature and it's so beautiful out here. How can I not take photos of the things that we see? Through my TikToks, my YouTube videos, Instagram stories. I post a lot on my Instagram stories. I don't really post photos that much, but I recently posted a photo. Maybe you should go like it because it's kind of cool. But a photo, I mean a bunch of photos. So get ready to scroll through. But I also like to document through words, I think, a lot. And that's why I play chess. I call it the game for overthinkers. One of my buddies makes fun of me and says that I basically play against myself because I'll run through like 742 different potential scenarios before I actually make my move. Honestly, since learning how to use that analysis feature on chess.com, my chess game has greatly improved. But unfortunately, I don't have my the rest of my notes. Okay, that was all. It's times like this where I realize the usefulness and utility of that weird just died on me and that was so rude but i just want to finish what i was saying i now understand the usefulness of those weird octopus like tripods because i was trying to put this and i was trying to like wrap it around that obviously it's not going to wrap because it's like a metal pole but the octopus arm totally would next time i'm gonna remember to bring that with me i'm also gonna remember to charge my <laughs> camera before i go somewhere so here's the tree and this tree is super sick love her too Oh, my favorite. I love baby lions so freaking much. Like, look at that. She's gorgeous. She's killing the game. Yes, mama. Oh my gosh, and these. Wow, that's cute. Mm, okay. Are there wolves in these woods? Good thing I'm leaving. <laughs>